An overview of life on Earth. Now, before you are born, your soul chose your pathway for that lifetime. The decisions are made at a pre-life meeting with your guardian angel, your overlighting angel, your main guide, and sometimes the member of the family that you're incarnating into. Sometimes these choices are for your growth, or to clear karma, and others they're in service to the family or humanity as a whole. You have chosen your family for a purpose. So it's your task to understand what lessons your parents, your siblings, or other relations and life conditions offer. Nothing happens by chance. Your energy attracts or repels situations people, success or failure, and everything into your life. You have the power to transform all things by changing your energy. Now you do this by understanding, forgiving, clearing stuck energy, or raising your frequency above the problem. The source of the situation or problem may have been in a past life, on this or another planet, or even on another universe. It may have originated with another aspect of your soul, but ultimately, everything can be transmuted by love. Because you attract or repel everything with your energy, you are responsible at a soul level for everything that happens. This means there's no blame or judgment. For example, if you're sitting in a stationary car and another car bumps into you, it's an opportunity without blame or judgment to understand what energy you are radiating to attract that situation. Your soul's on a long journey through many universes and planetary experiences. You are never alone. Angels, unicorns, dragons, spirit guides and helpers surround you and try to guide you. Earth is the only planet of free will. Here you have free will to disregard the guidance you're offered and make your own choices. You have free will to forgive or to hate, to accept or to judge. However, your guardian angel records your thoughts, words and actions. And these become your individual karmic records. Over lifetimes, these must be balanced. So if you have a debt at the end of one life, you must reincarnate to repay it. I believe we are all 100% responsible for our lives. And at the same time, we are all one and therefore responsible to each other. The more I know, the more I realize that there is to learn about life in the universes but there are some things I do know. Life on earth is governed by specific spiritual laws. And when you understand these, life becomes much easier. There are many paths up the spiritual mountain and at the peak, all is one. At the highest levels, we are all one. And the ultimate purpose of every lifetime is to raise our frequency so that we ascend to a higher dimension. And this is always done through love. Hope this helps you on your spiritual journey and lots of love.